how to take pictures and where those pictures go when you take them. So swipe up on the home screen and here is your camera icon. Now I would tell you, let's move that camera icon to our home screen so it's easier to get to it. Take your finger and just hold down on the camera button for one second. And if you just hold and don't do anything, it'll take it right to the home screen for you and then you can just move it where you want it and then just let go. So now our camera uh, app will always be on the home screen. I can tap on that. And now I can tee up taking a picture here. And let's just take a picture of this little thing on the corner here. So quick, quick overview of just the camera uh, menu. So a photo is taking a picture. You just tap the little shutter button to take a picture and you can zoom in and out using these numbers here. So if I tap on the two, it's going to zoom in. If I tap on 0.5, it's going to zoom out further. So that's all these buttons are. They're just the zoom options. To the right is the video button. I can tap on video if I want to record a video. And uh, there's also a voice command that you can say. If you're in the camera and you say record video, it will actually start recording a video just on the voice command, which is pretty cool. So let me just show you that one more time. Record video. So just that easy, it'll start recording a video just on the voice command. And just to show you when you're taking a video, if you tap on the shutter button here, you can take pictures of what you're recording all during. If you want to turn on the flashlight when you're taking a video because maybe it's kind of dark, you tap on this button here and then now your flash will come on while the video is playing and it will give you some extra light. There's two ways to look at the video that you've taken or the pictures after you've taken them. So when you're in the camera itself, tapping on the little circle to the left will take you right to the last thing that you've recorded. So we just recorded a video and now it took us right to our gallery and we can look at that video that we took. Okay. Now, if you really like that video and you want to save it as a, uh, a favorite, tap on the heart right here. And that'll save it as a favorite. And right now our video doesn't have any audio because we're muted. So if we tap here, it'll it's unmute. Right and then now your flash will come on. And there's our audio. Okay. So you can use this to mute or unmute the video as well. Now, that's the first way to look at a picture you've taken. The second way is this. You'll need to go to your gallery, which uh, right now mine is in the bottom right corner. And this is where we can see all the pictures and videos that we've taken. And if you go to pictures to the far left, it will sort all your pictures by date. So this is everything that we've taken today, everything we took you know, in previous days. So this is an easy way to just find important pictures. You can also go to albums and it will have the pictures separated uh, by category. So recent pictures or videos, favorites, um, screenshots. And you can go to the, the appropriate album and then look at those pictures. If you want to delete a picture, let's go into camera. Let's go to that video that we took. And you might say, oh, this video is kind of crappy. Why would I want to save that? Let's delete it. You'll tap on the trash can right here and that will delete that picture. Now, if you wanted to send it to someone, you can tap on this share button here and then it will tee it up so you can send it as an, uh, a, an email or you can send it as a text message as well. So that's a brief rundown of the camera, uh, mainly pictures and videos. Uh, again, video setting, photo setting. Now, if you want to jump to the front camera, you'll tap on this button and this will switch from the rear camera to your front camera. And you'll notice that some of the options are different if you're on the front camera versus the rear. So you'll just wanna be mindful of that. If you wanna turn on the flash for a picture, you're gonna uh, tap on the flash button here and change it from off to either auto or always on.
And what's cool when you take a picture or a selfie using the front camera, if your flash is on, it uses the screen as a light and it will flash when you take the picture to give you more light, just like this. Let's try it now. See that? It's using the screen as extra light so that your selfie will look better. I normally keep the flash off. The phone does a really good job of, of trying to take in as much light as it can. So only use the flash if it's really, really dark and you really need it, all right? So again, that's a quick rundown of how to take pictures and where to find the pictures after you've taken them. If the video was helpful, make sure you bump that like button down below. Also, here is gonna be a playlist of more videos on the A35 to help you continue learning. And you'll find another great video here as well. Thanks for watching. Take care. And as always, have a good one.